So back in seventh grade, I gave a presentation on corporate personhood, and ever since then, I've been pretty interested in this issue. So it's really all about transparency. Um, I hope that people use it on websites where they read about uh, politics every day. For example, if you use the extension when reading about a congressional vote on energy policy, maybe you'll discover that um, one of the sponsors of a bill has received hundreds of thousands of dollars from the oil and gas industry. Well, while we don't have a vote, I think we can still have a voice. Um, but I guess what's really important to me is that kids start caring about this issue, um, about the influence of money. Because, uh, again, it's getting worse, and this is a political system that we will be growing up in, and it's an issue that we'll eventually have to deal with. Hmm. So the response has been phenomenal. Um, Greenhouse has been downloaded almost 50,000 times now, and there have been many articles um, written in the U.S., and even some in countries around the world, things that I'm focused on, which is first, um, supplying even more data to users while keeping Greenhouse simple and easy to use, um, second is building Greenhouse into an interactive community of users instead of just a browser extension. And third, um, yeah, given the many requests I've received, helping expand the concept into other areas and even other countries. Anything, I really had an amazing time coding and launching this project, um, so I guess it got me more interested in a, in a job in technology. I enjoy playing tennis and photography too. Um, next year I'll be the, the photography editor for my school's newspaper. Uh, but really recently Greenhouse has been taking up a lot of my free time, so... I don't have